Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. Such a little thing. How many times you watched that thing? Guess you really miss her. Don't worry, we're almost there. You'll be able to look her up once we're on board. Sounds like you do have a lot of catching up to do. All right, everyone, we're here. It's sinking our orbit now. All this trouble over that chunk of rock. Deep space mining is a lucrative business, Miss Daniels. Each is seven is a gold mine, according to prospectors reports. Cobalt, silicon, osmium. Now, where is she? There she is. We have visual contact. So that's Ishimura. Impressive. The USG Ishimura. Biggest planet cracker in her class. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it all dark? I don't see any running lights. Corporal, take us in closer and hail them. And stay clear of that debris field. We're here to fix their ship, not the other way around. USG Ishimura, this is the emergency maintenance team of the USG Kellyan responding to your distress call. Come in, Ishimura. You're gonna need to boost the signal if their power's low. Yes, we know. Boost the signal. More. Never heard of a total communications blackout on one of these things. You'd think with a thousand people on board, someone would pick up the phone. <laughs> What is that? It's a busted array like we thought. Sounds like they're having problems with their encoder. You get us down there and Isaac and I can fix it. 48 hours max. All right, you have the lady. Take us in, let's see what needs fixing. Gravity tethers engaged. Automatic docking procedures a go. What the hell? Sir, the auto dock. What is it? We're off track, we're gonna hit the hole. Hit the blast shields. That guidance tethers damaged. Switch to manual, now. Inside the magnetic field? Are you insane? Abort! No, we can make it inside. Corporal, I gave you an order. The field's too strong. Is everyone okay? What? What the hell were you thinking? Were you trying to get us killed? I just saved our asses, Miss Daniels. If we had aborted at that speed and distance, we'd have smashed right into the side of the Ishimura. Now settle down, let's get to work. Corporal, report. I'm not getting any readings from the port booster, and we've lost comms and autopilot. It'll take some time to fix. All right, let's get some extra hands from flight deck to help out. Hold still, Isaac. I'm syncing up everyone's rig with the ship. Okay, we're done. Clean bill of health for everyone. All right. We've still got a job to do. We're moving out. Seems like everyone was trying to pack in a hurry. There should be a security detail in here. Yeah? Well, there's not. There's nobody here. I can't pick up any broadcasts. But that security console is still live. Isaac, log in and see what you can find. Kendra, get that elevator back online. The power's dead. <laughs> Thank you. 
Look, if we all cooperate, we can figure this out a lot sooner. Let's get that computer display on Isaac. That doesn't look good. She's taking a lot of damage. The tram system's offline. Getting around's gonna be difficult. The air seems to be flung again. That's a start. What the hell was that? Automatic quarantine must have tripped when the filtration system restarted. Everybody relax. What was that? Did you hear that? Not sure. What the hell? I don't know. Something's in the room with us. them on the way over here. Are you okay? More what? What the hell are those things? Is that the crew? Keep your voice down. Whatever they are, they're not friendly, and half the doors on this ship are locked because of the quarantine. Now, we have to get to the bridge, but first, we gotta repair the tram system. You're crazy, Hammond. You're gonna get us all killed. If you listen to me, I will get you out of here alive. Now, what's wrong with the tram? The data board is fried, but there should be a spare in the maintenance bay. There's also a broken tram blocking the tunnel that needs to be repaired. Damn it! Everything is on the other side of this quarantine. We can't reach it from here. No, we can't. But you can. Isaac, if I can get to the bridge, I should be able to access the personnel files. You fix the tram, and I'll help you find Nicole. Isaac, be careful. Shooting them in the body didn't seem to work. Go for the limbs. Dismember them. That should do the job. Conserve ammo by dismembering enemy limbs and doing extra damage. Listen up, car is trash. We managed to get it back to the repair depot, but now the auto loader is fried. I need to face this module brought down here now. If we don't get this piece of shit off the track, it's gonna jam up the whole system. Retracing damage tram car. Please stand by. Isaac, you did it. The tram is blocking the whole system. When you get the computer online, you'll be able to call the tram from the control room. Faster the better. I can hear something lying around out there. Isaac, I've patched into the deck security system. It took some work, but I've got the door to the maintenance bay unlocked. The data board should be somewhere inside. That's it, Isaac. Take the board back to tram control and plot it into the computer array. That should get the tram system back online. Now online. Shipwide tram system reinitialized. All trams now operational. Tram arriving at flight deck station. 
Quarantine lifted. All right, we're on board and heading to the bridge. Good work. Strange. The quarantine lifted. Whatever was in the flight lounge must have left. That's lucky for us. Isaac, get back to the Kellyon and prep it for launch. We'll find out what we can from the bridge and meet you there. If we live that long... You're out of your league, Hammond. This is suicide. We're going your to die out here. Your lack of confidence in me is duly really noted, Miss Daniels. But I have a mission to complete, and that's exactly what I am going to do, with or without you. Do we understand each other? Just get us out of here alive. to the shuttle. That was our ride home. It's the only way off the ship. Kendra. No, Hammond! This changes everything! Just let me think. Can you access the command computer? It's no good. There's an executive lockdown of all primary systems. Without the captain's authorization, I can't access them. Well, where's the captain? Here he is. Captain Benjamin Mathias. Location? Med lab. Status? Deceased. What? How? I can't access that information. Find the captain and you'll find his rig. With his authorization codes, I can crack this computer wide open. Damn it. Isaac, I'm sending the tram back to your location. Get to the medical deck and find that rig as fast as you can. What was that? Oh. <laughs> I knew you would come. Just like you said. I I saved this for you. Can I go? Use to move or throw objects to take me. Isaac, are you there? We were attacked. Kendra's gone. One minute she was there, and I, I can't believe I lost her. We can still do this. Get me the captain's rig codes, and we'll find Nicole. Looks like the crew barricaded the door to the emergency wing. We have to blow through it to get to the morgue. Get some thermite from medical storage, and a shock pad from zero-g therapy. Should be down the corridor. God, communication is useless in all this static. Finally convinced Jurgens to show me the video feed from the colony. And what I saw was glorious. Breathtaking. Miners undergoing a transformation into something extraordinary. I must know more. Even as the believer within me wants to become one of them, the scientists to recover the I need to study one of these necromorphs, as kind as you really could put it. I need to witness this infection firsthand. Perhaps that patient from the colony. What in God's name is going on down there? I think that's precisely the point, Doctor. God's work. I'm not so sure of that. We have to assume that the colony's problems are somehow connected to the marker. You can assume all you want to. I do not. The marker is glorious and divine. You, you know that. God moves in mysterious ways. 
Anyway, we'll have it on board tomorrow. You can analyze it all you want to. What are you so worried about? Worried? Captain, people are dying down there, killing each other. Is this madness the transformation unitology teaches us? Doctor, Terence, there will always be risk when the stakes are high. And here, they're enormous. It could change everything. And that's what worries me. <laughs> Medical officer Nicole Brennan transmitting ship wide. We need more help. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds. We are not equipped to deal with this. Get him to the table. Hold him. Nurse, you hold him down. And record him. That was Nicole, right? I can't tell from here when that log was made. I'm sure she's around here somewhere. Hello? Can anybody hear me? My name is Eileen Fisk. I just woke up in here and everybody was gone. I don't know what's happening. Why did they all leave? I'm going to try and find someone. If you can hear this, please come for me. I can hear scratching in the wall. Oh. Hello? Who's there? Are, are you a doctor? Why is everyone... Wait, I know you. You're Harris, the prisoner from the colony. You killed that nurse. Help! Somebody help me! Please! symptoms are acute depression, insomnia, and hallucination. Incidents of violence and even murder also indicate extreme paranoia. Dr. Mercer has advised that I bring some of the affected on board for study. Dr. Wellen, the planet side psychiatrist, has reported that his own analysis has been fruitless. I'm hesitant to rely on Dr. Mercer at this point, but I need his expertise. We need solutions, and we need them quickly. received and they look good thank god i'll start accessing the captain's records right now head to the tram station and i'll contact you there i'm going to find out what the hell happened to this ship isaac 
Somehow one of them found a way down to the captain's nest. I managed to contain it in a damaged escape pod. Lifting executive lockdown now. I found the deck logs. Whatever is happening around here, it came from the planet when they cracked it open. It spread to the colony and reached the ship. Isaac, this isn't an infection. It's some form of alien life. <laughs> Shit, we've got bigger problems. The ship's engines are offline and our orbit is decaying. Get over to the engineering deck ASAP while I stay here and figure out what the problem is. Personal log. Acting Chief Engineer Jacob Temple. It's been two days since they pulled that planet open, since the captain died. The panic, the riots, they were nothing compared with what came after. Our friends, our co-workers, started coming back. Changed, coming back to kill us, drag us away. Rucker disappeared this morning, and I have to assume he's dead. My crew, they're starting to crack. I'm trying to keep an eye on them, but right now I have bigger problems. We're hemorrhaging fuel, and the primary engine is laboring. Danvers and I are going to try to reach the fuel depot to see if we can fix it. Temple out. Shut it, Danvers! Shut it! Engineering log. Temple reporting. Someone has shut off the fuel lines to the primary engine and damaged the valves in the process. They need to be repaired before I can reopen them, but we're running out of time. With the engine offline, orbit decay will begin in less than ten hours. I just can't understand who would do this. If it's one of those crazy unitologist bastards, I'll break their neck! I said they were coming. We never should have let them live. Shut up, Danvers! Help me with the tools. Temple out. Whatever you did, it's working, Isaac. I have a fuel reading. It's only a quarter full, but that's enough to restore orbit once you bring the engines online. What the hell? Oh, false alarm. I thought I saw something. Centrifuge activated. Re-establishing balance with planetary cargo. Gravity restored. Entering vacuum. Doing great, Isaac. Centrifuge and gyros are both 100% and stabilized. Now get out of there and focus on the engine. I don't know how much time we have left. Isaac, can you hear me? It's Kendra. They attacked me. I went for it, and Hammond just he just disappeared. Kendra, where are you? Nice to see you're alive and well, Hammond. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I can hear them moving outside, but I don't think they know I'm in here. I can launch an app from here. I hacked the route and found some reports from the colony. Even before they cracked the planet, the colonists were experiencing widespread dementia. It seems to be related to some artifact they found on the planet. Something called the marker. I'll keep looking. I've got your location, and I'm going to unlock the door to fuel storage. You can get to the engine chamber from there. It's working. We're online and functional. Finally, some good news. Get a tram to the bridge, Isaac. I'm going to take us back into a jeep station. Wait, wait, we're not safe yet. The ship's asteroid defense system is offline. On the way up, the ship's going to pass through a debris field thrown up from the planet crack. Will be ripped to pieces unless you restart it. God damn it! I'll start working on it from here. Isaac, meet me at the bridge. You can do more good here than I can. Isaac, come in. Kendra's right. The ADS is completely shot. I'll need your help to fix this. Kendra, if you can hear me, see if you can get into the ship's reports. It sounds like you have better access from there. When were you going to tell us about the artifact, Hammond? This marker. 
I don't know anything about that. It's referenced in the captain's records. They brought it up from the planet. It's on the ship? In cargo. They think it's of alien origin, but I don't know what the hell it is. Really? CEC didn't know anything about it. You're lying. Back up! I am not the bad guy here. We're all shaky right now. You're gonna have to trust that I don't know anything about it. <laughs> We've entered the debris field. Get to the captain's nest. I'll explain everything later. Hammer down. right at your feet. I'm reading heavy damage, but containment looks solid. Life support is stabilized. We've got to get the ADS working. Isaac. Damn, you scared me. The place is making me jumpy. Fucking asteroids coming through the roof. Look, I know Kendra doesn't trust me, but I don't know anything about a marker or anything else. This is supposed to be a repair mission. Plain and simple. This mess is the asteroid defense system. I can fix these boards, but the main power routing is shot. You're going to have to reroute them manually through at least three junction boxes to activate the primary cannon. Oh, but first... You need to activate the atrium elevators from bridge security. You can use them to get to the junction boxes. By the way, Isaac, be careful. I saw something out there. I don't know what. I only got a glimpse. But it was big. Really big. Shit! Stand back! Oh, that one was dead when I sealed the pod. These things don't die easily. Tried for mutiny. Kind, make them listen to reason. Settle down, then. Hold him. By maritime law, Article 5469, I hereby declare Captain Benjamin Matthias unfit for duty. The marker must be delivered to the church. Terence, please. I'm sorry, Ben, but I can't let you do this. Traitor. Heretic! Hold his head. Matter up! Hold him! He's dead. No, it was an accident. I, I had to stop him. Arrest the doctor. Listen up. I've gone over the MedSci reports. These things are biorecombinators. They take dead tissue, absorb it, and mold it into new forms. One iteration seems to have the sole purpose of infecting corpses. The others, well, seem to be making corpses to infect. And that body tissue we keep seeing on the walls is part of it, too. I found a report that says it's a habitat changer.
Exiting zero gravity. <gasps> Exiting vacuum. Wait! Isaac Hammond, you're not gonna believe this. Objects are falling. Something's poisoning hydroponics air production, and whatever it is, it's filling the deck up with that organic stuff. We're not going to have any air to breathe soon. But if I understand these lab reports correctly, I think I can make a poison to destroy it. Head to medical. It should have everything you need. Will this never end? Isaac, get to medical and mix together whatever Kendra's come up with. I'm heading to hydroponics. If I can slow it down, that might keep us breathing long enough to fight it. Isaac, I can smell the contaminated air from here. It's spreading faster than I expected. I'm trying to isolate it, but it's not going to buy us much time. We have to get that thing off this ship. The chemicals you need are in the chemistry lab. I'll hack the door for you when you get there. You can't stand in the way of God's plan. The natural order. Are you... Are you blind? Let the rest. Looks like someone has reprogrammed the door locks on this deck. And recently, too. I guess we're not alone here after all. Someone doesn't want you in this part of the ship. You're close to the chemistry station. Once you get the chemicals, you're also going to need a DNA sample of the alien tissue. For so long, Dr. Charles Lesser, I now have a live subject for my study. I'm eager to validate my tissue regeneration. Initial restraint was problematic, but now the patient's resting comfortably. He trusts me, Dr. Kite. He puts his life in my hands. He knows his part in all of this. Understands what I'm doing. The forehead has been swapped clean and marked. What are you doing with that? I'm not attempting to create a passage to insert the sample no, to no, no! Your fight for survival is admirable but pointless. Uh, and yet you keep on going. It almost makes me think that we had hope as a species. Am I the only one who sees that we have died out a long time ago? We just haven't accepted it yet. Stop running. Stop your struggle. Our future. Your future, the future of our race, ends here. Allow me to introduce you to humanity's child, the children that will replace us. Our greatest creation. Where the hell have you been? I'm trying to panic. It's bad down here. It's really bad. 
find a DNA sample of the growth. According to lab records, there's an inert sample stored in the ICU. A Dr. Mercer was apparently doing intensive research on it. I've been trying to contact Hammond, but all I'm getting is static. Isaac, your you persistence to surprises me. Holding on to your final breath, you claw your way along. You hold on to what was once your war. But now, it belongs to the children. Be glad of the knowledge that your death will bring their birth. Listen. Can you hear it? It's coming. So you... Persona, Dr. Chalice Mercer. The specimen continues to respond well to my experiments. Its cellular fortitude, not to mention elasticity, is remarkable. Dr. Kine, I'm sure, would disapprove. But I do not anticipate that issue as the good doctor is busying himself with the marker. As if that matters now. He has also succumbed to the same dementia that afflicted the colony. Only yesterday he told me he had spoken to his wife. But Amelia Kine has been dead for some years. <laughs> My subject grows restless. Patience. Your time is soon. Very soon. Adding sample 9797 to chemical compound. Final mixing required. That's it, Isaac. Now you just need to... This has gone far enough. Accept your part in the God's plan. Embrace your own extinction. Warning. Life support system failure on medical... Where the hell was that? Please evacuate immediately. Isaac, he's decompressed the entire deck, and I'm being locked out of those systems. All the air has been vented into space. You should be able to bring it back online from the security station, but you don't have much time. You've got everything you need to make the poison. Now get back to the chemistry lab. What are you going to do? Do it fast. Get out of your breathing. You're cutting out, Hammond. I'm going to try to switch over. <sighs> Shit. I lost his signal. I'll continue scanning for his location. You have to get that compound mixed. I've got more intel on the atmosphere. A survivor's report says a massive creature entered the hydroponics deck from outside the ship. That's when the air quality began degrading. The survivor called it the Leviathan. Let's hope that poison works. Head back to the tram station and get up to hydroponics as fast as you can. Still no response from Hammond, so be careful. There's no telling how contaminated that deck is. I'm beginning to truly admire your spirit. Misplaced as it may be. I think... I think you should see the whole plan. You should not spurn the hive mind's offerings. You deserve to witness that at least. Perhaps now you would understand. The work I have done must continue. Will continue. I, Dr. Charles Mercer, shall serve as the catalyst to the salvation of our species. These specimens will return to Earth with me. I will spread their divine glory across the entire planet. I will leave you with my creation. Embrace the inevitable.
me see of that thing. I've managed to override Mercer's lockdown. There's a secondary tram station nearby, and you can take it to hydroponics. Let's just hope there's enough time. Hydroponics log, Dr. Elizabeth Cross reporting. I'm pleased to say that we're working close to maximum capacity at the present time. All flora is healthy and thriving, and food yield has created a surplus. I was going to pass the surplus on to the colony, but the captain has given a no-fly order. I want to note my opposition to that order. Everyone knows they're in trouble down there, and I don't see what denying them our surplus will achieve. Isaac. Good to see you in one piece. Don't take your helmet off. The hair's rotten. I gotta look at it. It's huge. You won't believe it. Shut itself in food storage. Crew that was on this deck. I think they're what's poisoning the air. They've been transformed. I saw one of them. Bloated. Swollen. They're like poison factories. We need to take them out where we can still breathe. Hammond! I thought you were dead. You need to get to cleaner air. You're not going to be able to help Isaac in your condition. Isaac, I'm scanning the area now. He's right. There's something really big in food storage. But I can't get a good scan. Monitor readings are off the scale. Be careful. That's the door to food storage. But I can't override the integrity lockdown. You have to destroy the pods to bring the air quality up. I suppose I should be glad that Ham's alive, but I still don't trust him. I think he's hiding something about the marker. Isaac, make us whole again. Returning to normal. Damn it! He's gone again. No sign of his rig anywhere. It's up to us now. 
I've got a plan to get off the ship. I've located an SOS beacon on the mining deck. If you can get down there and activate it, we might be able to send a distress call. Oh god. I don't know how much longer the dark will hold. This may be our last chance of getting out of here alive, Isaac. There's an asteroid loaded up in the mining bay waiting to be smelted. If you attach the SOS beacon to it, you can launch it away from the ship to make a clean broadcast. The beacon's on the maintenance subdeck. You can launch the asteroid from the control room. <sighs> Damn, the control room is locked. It looks like they keep an emergency access key on the processing subdeck. Couldn't be easy, could it? I don't know how much more of this I can take. This is Temple. I found Elizabeth, but there isn't a single space-worthy vessel in the whole goddamn bay. Jacob, hurry up! We need to find a beacon. There's gotta be one around here somewhere. That's the key, Isaac. It'll get you into the control room so you can launch the asteroid. Don't forget to attach the beacon first. I read another report on the colonist dementia. It seemed to start after they removed the marker from the planet. God knows how long it was down there. Dr. Kai, what the hell are you doing? No, 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 no. Ah, get back! Come any closer, and... and I'll shoot him. Give me the access codes to the cargo bay. You idiot! This is processing! Why the hell would I have codes to cargo? Don't lie to me! I'm sick of everyone lying to me. It is imperative that I get the marker. Give me those codes. I don't have them. Is this what you did to the captain? Go on, shoot me if you've got the balls. Idiot! It's the only way to stop it. The only way to end it. He's completely lost it. Somebody call security. Isaac? Is that really you? It feels like it's been so long. But I can help you now. Come with me. get over to you, but I'll find a way. I love you. This will all be over soon. Isaac! Hey, I lost your signal for a while. You had me worried. I see you've got the beacon, so head for the mining bay and attach it to the asteroid. I've been running trajectory calculations, and if we launch soon, there's a good chance the asteroid can reach a safe distance to begin transmitting. Still no sign of Hammond. In his state, I can't imagine he's still alive. Entering zero gravity.
warning. Payload 8772 is no longer tethered. Untrained personnel should leave the area immediately. <gasps> Beacon's on its way. All functions normal and broadcasting wideband. Now we just have to hope somebody's listening. I'll position the array receiver. I thought I saw my brother again. He waved to me like nothing was wrong. Okay. I should be able to leave this channel open. What? The comms array receiver isn't responding. Isaac, can you get back to the bridge? We need that array online or we can't receive signals from anyone responding to the beacon. Things are looking up. A military ship just shocked in. The USM Valor. I don't know what it was doing out there. It must have gotten our distress signal. We can't talk to it until the comms array is fixed. I'm gonna hack the door to communications for you. Get in there and find the comms control station. Isaac, the door to communications is open. But I've been getting some weird feedback spikes on the local comms. I think someone's listening in on us, so be careful. Communications lock. First comms operator Bailey reporting. The ship is under attack, but requests to issue a distress call have been repeatedly denied by Captain Matthias. He won't say it, but everyone on the bridge knows why. This is an illegal operation in a prohibited system. We've all known for months, and we kept our mouths shut. Not anymore. Mayday! 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 This is USG Ishimura! This is... What the hell? I don't believe this. The whole comm system is offline. Now he's gone too far. Bailey out. Communications array offline. A service technician has been notified. That comms array is in bad shape. We need at least six working dishes for a strong enough signal. Make sure they're aligned symmetrically so there are no power gaps. Communications array realigned. Messages can now be received. That's it. It's working. Get back to communications and use the control panel to send our coordinates to the Valor. This is USM Valor, widecasting on all frequencies to USG Ishimura in response to your SOS. We picked up your escape pod, number 47, and are en route to your position. This message will repeat every 30 seconds until you respond. What? Isn't that the escape pod Hammond jettisoned? One of those things was on board. No. 
No, this isn't going to happen. USM Valor. Come in, Valor. Our signal isn't strong enough. I'm going to open the blast doors to boost the signal. Error. Blast door blockage detected. Please contact the repair technician. Shit! Isaac, there's something big on the hull of the ship, directly above the comms array. Something organic. I don't know what it is, and I don't care. We have to get the doors open to transmit to the Valor. You should have a clear shot from ADS Cannon 48. Get to the cannon and blow it out into space. <laughs> Are you there? Thank God you're all right. I've been trying to reach you. Someone's been blocking my rig signal remotely. <coughs> A crash must have interrupted the signal block. Hammond, where have you been? <coughs> Surviving. Barely. I found some med supplies and packed myself up. Listen. I'm calling aboard on the mission. Fuck the CEC and fuck the chain of command. We have to get the hell out of here. I think I've located a shuttle on the crew deck. The flight log says it needs a new singularity core, but we can probably salvage one from the Valor. I can see the tail end of it sticking out from the side of the Ishimura. I'm headed down there now to find a way inside. I'll meet you there. Come and out. Isaac, if what he says is true about the shuttle, we might have a chance of getting out of here. Head to the cargo bay and see if you can help Hammond. In his condition, he may not last long. Entering zero gravity. Isaac, one of the Valor's weapons ripped open in the crash. Those green orbs you see are highly radioactive, and the Valor's airlock has sealed itself. You're going to have to throw those into space before you can get into the ship. Material. The part you're looking for will be in the engine room at the back of the ship. I'm reading massive damage, so you may need to find an alternate route to get there. The infection process is doing something strange to these soldiers. They all have built-in stasis units in their body armor. The infection is merging the stasis unit into their flesh or something. Making them move fast. Real fast. Be careful.
Isaac. You made this call again. Isaac, I'm tracking your position, but it doesn't look like I can reach you. This damn ship was nearly shared in half. I made it to the bridge. It's a mess here. These poor bastards didn't stand a chance. I'm going to override all door locks so you can get to the engine room. I'll try and catch up with you there. There's a better use for it than just running away. You must understand, the forces at work here are greater than you can imagine. If you leave now, you condemn all humanity. The planet will never stop, never rest unless the marker is returned. Don't you see? The church is wrong. This is all a trap. I've seen it. Please, you must help me. Hostiles on board. This is not a drill. Hostiles are alien. Repeat, alien and extremely dangerous. All personnel have weapons ready and fire at will. Engine power failure. Is that it? You got it? Oh my god. You've got it! That's the piece we need. Get to the crew deck. Isaac! Over here! I've been trying to reach you, my comm was out. You got the singularity call, that's our singularity here. Get that call, Mr. Donald! Don't me! Warning, 
Catastrophic failure of fuel containment. Evacuate the vessel immediately. Isaac, I've located the shuttle Hammond found. <laughs> Shit. No good. That shuttle's brain dead. Someone removed the navigation cards. God knows why. There's three of them scattered around the deck. I'm downloading their locations. I can't access the doors from here, so you'll need a crew key. If you can find those parts, I think we can get that shuttle operational again. What do you claim to when all must seem so utterly hopeless around you? Dr. Cross was a true believer. She had faith. And now she awaits her transformation. A rebirth. Are you ready to ascend, Mr. Temple? Of course you are. Have no fear. You will play your part soon enough. Witness the conviction of a true believer! They are ready. Take them. Embrace them. Mr. Clark, I really must speak with you. I'm very close to your position and and I know you want to hear what I have to say. I can explain all this. But what happened? When you have the nav cards, I'll let you into the security station. We must talk. Hurry! The life support system in Sleep Lock B has been shut down. You'll have to find an override nearby to get to the door. as we always knew we would. Unitology is truth, and your death is We deterred by the physical methods of transformation. Soon, you will be beyond any physical concerns. You must have faith, fools. This is what we have been searching for all these years. This is what we have been waiting for. Don't listen to them. Come back! Come back! How can you be turning away from the church in this vital hour? Do not abandon your faith. What's happening on the colony is not a tragedy. It's God. This truth is even more fantastic. On the planet below us, we have found a marker. God's plan is unfolding and we are its inheritors. We will ascend as we always knew we would. Unitology is truth. And your death is the first phase. Be deterred by the physical methods of transformation. Soon you will be beyond any physical concerns. You must have faith, fools. This is what we have been searching for all these years. This is what we have been waiting for. Don't listen to them. Come back. Come back. How can you be turning away from this? It's not a tragedy.
needs to be released before launch. The control platform there. I need you to guide the undocking procedure while I start the shuttle's engines. This will make us whole again. Hurry! I'll take the shuttle up to the flight deck where the marker's being held. Shut 
But we need that shuttle. Let's keep him on our side. For now. Your time has come. No need to be frightened. No reason to fight. Many have gone before us. And now it's time for us to take the voyage together. Transcend death. The future take its course. Join me as I gaze upon the face of God. Mr. Clark, I'm approaching the shuttle hangar. You must, you must find your way to the cargo bay. The Barkery, it's being stored in there. There's a cargo loading lift there you can use to deliver the marker up to the hangar. Please, you must help me with this. It's the only way. I restored power to the elevator. Take it up to the hangar bay and get the marker on the shuttle. I'm heading up to the flight deck now. Oh god, we're just gonna run for it. Wish me luck. shuttle down now. The automated loading controls aren't responding. You'll have to shut down gravity in the hangar bay, and then manually bring the marker directly beneath the shuttle. Loading cargo shipment 782. It's on board. Please come and join me. Together we can stop this hive mind. We can end this nightmare. At last! Over here! Hurry! There's no time to waste! We must do it! Wait... Amelia... Where are you going? Sorry, Isaac. I couldn't let him go through with it. I suppose I should thank you for finding the marker. We even managed without help from the USM Valor. Thank you for finding it, by the way. My department's been looking for this place for a long time. See what kind didn't know us? It was the government's mess to begin with. This whole planet is one big experiment. The marker? This <laughs> divine relic? Made by man. They reverse engineered it a couple of hundred years ago from the real marker, a true alien artifact recovered on Earth. They dug it up, studied it, and they made it their own. Then they brought it to Aegis 7 and activated it. And you've seen the result. The stuff of nightmares. They sealed the system, and no one would have been the wiser. But then the CEC blunders in and starts tearing the planet apart. The experiment was still alive. Kind was right about the hive mind. The marker would contain it, but that doesn't matter now, does it? I have the marker, and this entire system can go to hell. For what it's worth, you did a great job, Isaac. See you around. Or maybe not. Isaac, Nicole, I need you to help me. Help us, now! I'm... I'm in the flight control room. Please, Isaac, hurry! Please! I love you. Is that really you? I never thought we'd be together. 
again. God, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for what I did. I never wanted to hurt you. You need to get it back now, Isaac. You can pilot the shuttle remotely from here. Make us whole again. Make us whole again. She can't escape her fate. None of us can. Here it comes. I'll reprogram the shuttle so we can fly down to the colony. So close, Isaac. Now go! Get on the shuttle. I'll meet you there. You're doing the right thing, Isaac. We're together now. The way it always should have been. I knew you'd come back for me. Nothing can stop us now. Isaac, use one of the loaders to get the marker off the shuttle. Isaac, the marker needs to be returned to the pedestal chamber. Use the loader to bring it there and place it on the pedestal. Replace what was taken and make us whole again. This is Sergeant Newman, PSEC. We've lost all the shuttles. One of them just took off and came straight back down and crashed into the bay. Took a couple of hundred people and all the remaining shuttles with it. If anyone can hear this, do not land. Do not land. Isaac, you're almost there. You'll have to restore power to the bridges to move the marker through this area. Look for a control station at the end of the main base. you'd return to me. We are whole again, Isaac. We are whole. Emergency. Geo-orbital gravity tethers offline. Tectonic load released. Impact imminent. Evacuate this area immediately. You really didn't think I 
think I was just going to walk away with you. I can't do that. The marker's coming with me. It's a shame. I was starting to like you. Even if you are insane. What, you don't believe me? Take a look at yourself. Better yet, take a look at the video from Nicole. And this time, watch it right to the end. Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. Such a little thing. In the end, it all comes down to this one little thing. I didn't want it to end like this. I really wanted to see you again. Just once. I loved you. I always loved you.
I wish I could talk to you. I'm so...